Hi everybody, welcome back to Sacred Body Studio. My name is Fabi. We're gonna start our mini routine today. We're gonna start standing. So we are gonna do a couple of breaths here. So just keep your hands on your tummy, relax your shoulders, smooth your knees. We take a deep breath. Inhale through your nose. Exhale through your mouth with the sensation of fog in a glass. Again, inhale. Exhale. Inhale, exhale, and one more. Inhale, and exhale. Well done. Now we're going to do the same, but we're going to keep our mouth closed. We're gonna, uh, we are going to—we are contracting our epiglottis and using more our diaphragm to make our breath longer and deep. That's why it's called Ujjayi breath. So let's go. Inhale, exhale with the same sensation, mouth closed. One more time, inhale, exhale. One more, and exhale. Great. So we're going to try to keep this breath, but when you get tired to using you, the contraction of your epiglottis, it's okay, just come back to your normal breath. We're going to keep our hands on our hips, engage your tummy. So how we can engage our tummy and the pelvic floor muscles, so we have the sensation of pulling the pubic bone, towards the belly button, and then the belly button towards the chest bone to elevate our chest and open our chest. So hold your hips, we're gonna step forward, or we're gonna slide the right foot, and we're gonna come up. So we're just gonna go forward and backwards, forward and backwards. Let's go eight. To find stability, pull up your tummy and push your foot down. If not, you can hold the wall. Let's go for six, five, four, Three, just swing it. Two, and one more. Now we change the leg, okay? Ready? So forward, backwards. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, and get your tummy. Four, three, two, and one. Now we're gonna do it crossing at the front. So we go 10, nine, Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and last one. If you feel it's difficult for you to keep your imbalance, just hold the wall. Let's go other leg. Ready? Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, woohoo, two. And one. And we're going to repeat the same at the back. Remember, find balance by pulling up your tummy, pushing down the base foot. Let's go at the back. Ten. Nine. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two. And last. Other leg. Ten. Nine. Eight. Seven. Six, five, four, just to mobilize our legs, two, and last one. So from here, we're gonna hold the elbows, right arm at the front, lift it just above your shoulders, lift the heels, balance yourself on your big toes, take a deep breath, inhale, and exhale. We squat, release your arms to the front as low as you can go without forcing, Exhale, forward bend, bend your knees if you feel it's too much tension of your to oh, if your torso is too high. Hold your elbows again with the right at the front and we just swing sideways. We hold here. Breathe in. Inhale deep. Exhale. Let's go three. No pulling the legs. You can always bend your knees. One more deep breath. Inhale and exhale. Back to center, drop your hands, roll up your spine. Come all the way up, roll your shoulders backwards. We're going to lift the right knee, and we're going to catch our knee and pull it closer to us. Remember, to find stability, pull up your tummy and push down the base leg, and, but also you can hold a wall, and that's it. Let's hold here for four breaths. Inhale deep. Exhale, push your big toes strong on the ground to give you stability. Let's go for three. And exhale. 
Let's go to and exhale. And just one more inhale and exhale. We drop that foot. I know this is a little bit hard, but it's fine. Okay, let's go other leg. So we come up, we pull in, and we hold here for four and exhale. Activate your tummy and your leg to give you stability. Let's go two more. Inhale, exhale, pull up your tummy. Just one more. Inhale and exhale well done release your foot let's come back so this time left arm go at the front lift your heels balance on your big toe take a breath inhale and exhale now we got squat as much as we can go take a deep breath inhale and exhale forward bend we hold the elbows with the opposite the left arm at this, this point at the top and we just swing again for four breaths. Inhale and exhale. When your knees, if you feel pain or you feel too much tension at the back of the legs. Two more breaths together. Inhale and exhale. Just one more. And exhale. Drop your hands. Inhale and exhale. We roll up. Oh, this is, feels good. Roll your shoulders. For you feel the stretches really nice, you need to avoid the point that you start to be, they start to be painful. Remember that. When the pain starts, or you bend your knees, or you adapt, or you go less, but never hold the stretches with pain. This is to give us mobility, but if we hold the stretches with pain, our nervous system is tightening more the are making the muscles tighter just to protect you don't get hurt so the idea here is as far as you don't have pain okay so let's go on the side so remember pull up push down move the knee to the side and pull your knee on the side this time you can hold the wall if it's more comfortable for you your big toe big toe is the main thing for balance for breath here inhale lift your chest exhale Let's go for three. That pulling of the pubic bone towards the belly button, belly button towards the chest bone. One more together. Inhale and exhale. Release. Well, well done. Let's go other leg. Ready? Pull up, push down. Inhale and exhale. Remember that breath with your breath. Inhale and exhale. Let's go for two more. Inhale and exhale. Just one more. Inhale and exhale. We release. Well done. Let's go one more time. Hold your elbows. Lift your heels. Take a breath. Inhale. Exhale. We squat as far as we don't force our knees. And exhale forward bend. Hold your elbows again, rocking sideways. This time, right arm go at the front. We just go for four and three, two, one more. Drop your hands, inhale and exhale. Roll up the spine, roll your shoulders backwards. Now we're gonna go the figure of four. So the right arm rests onto the left thigh and we're just gonna squat. Some of us, we keep our hands just in prayer position. Some of you can move the hands down. Just don't close the figure of four between your legs. So let's hold here, four breath. Inhale and exhale. Let's go for three. And flex this foot to engage your leg muscles. Bend the left leg. One more breath, everybody. Inhale. And exhale. Slowly we roll up our spine and we release the leg. You can shake your legs if you feel like it was a little bit tight. And let's go other side. Close. Cross, sorry. Figure of four with your legs. Squat. You can stay here or you can rub your hands. You can also hold the wall if you feel it's too much challenge for you in the balance. Let's hold for four. You can hook the arm with your foot if you feel comfy. Let's go for three. Two. And just one more. 
Inhale, exhale, we just roll up. Well done. Back again, hold your elbows, lift your heels, balance yourself on your big toes. Take a breath. Inhale and exhale. Release your heels. Squat as far as comfortable for you. Exhale, forward bend. Hold the elbows, left arm at the top, and we just re uh, swing sideways. Inhale deep. Exhale. Let's go three. Let's get two. And just one more. Back to center. Drop your hands. Inhale and exhale. Roll up. Well done. Roll your shoulders backward. It's fantastic. I'm going to turn on the side to do the next part. So we're going to catch the right foot with you right hand, we push our pelvis forward, we can stay here just to stretch our, our quads, or we can lean and move the chest just parallel to the ground and you tie as well, your foot pushing away from you, and again, same about balance, hold for breath, inhale, exhale, let's go for three, exhale, let's go two, just one more. And slowly release. Well done. Let's take the other leg. So remember, we can stay just here, holding the stretch, holding the wall if we need to. And if not, we just go to the version to just lean and keep up a parallel to the ground. Inhale to prepare, engage your tummy. We lean. You can bend the base leg to give you more support, or you can keep it straight. We hold for four, and exhale. Let's go for three, two, and just one more. That's great, everybody. Release. How it feels. Good. Now we're going to do the last one. This time, arms come up without holding. Lift the heels. Take a breath here. Inhale. Exhale. We go forward bend, squat, and forward bend. This time, let the hands rest beside your feet. You can bend your knees. Press the ground. We hold for breath. Inhale deep. And exhale. No pain at the back of the legs. Three. And exhale. Two. And exhale. Just one more. And exhale. Inhale. And exhale. Roll up, everybody. Oh, great. Roll your shoulders backwards. Super. Now we're going to do, from here we're going to step backwards with the left foot. Hips facing forward. We're going to keep both legs straight, okay? Move your arms at the back, interlace your fingers. You interlace your fingers and straight your arms. You can bring the wrists together, it's okay. Now we're going to go forward. It doesn't really matter how low you can go. It's just as far as you don't have pain. Ready? Inhale. Exhale forward, keep your legs straight. Doesn't matter if you go tiny, it's okay. We hold here for four. Inhale. And exhale. Let's go for three. Two. Just one more. Inhale. And exhale, push the ground, and we raise our torso. Good. We're just going to swap the legs. So this time is the right leg backwards. You can open as much as you can. Just make sure that your foot is facing forward and your hips are facing forward. And I'm just go at the back, open your chest, inhale, and exhale, forward bend. We hold for four. Three. Two. And just one more. Inhale. And exhale. Push the ground. And 
wow, it feels really good. Remember, only feels good. We don't hold with pain. Put your legs together, but this time open your legs a little bit wider and open the toes to the corner. We're going to squat down as far as you keep your heels on the ground. Doesn't matter if you don't go too low, but make sure that your heels remain on the ground. Push your arms against the legs, straight your back as much as possible for you. We take a deep breath. Inhale and exhale. Now we drop the left arm and we twist towards to the right and we take a deep breath. Inhale and exhale. Now we drop our hand, we twist other side. Feel a lovely sensation. Take a deep breath. Inhale and exhale. We drop again, we go other side. Take a breath, inhale, and exhale. And drop again, other side, take a breath, inhale, and exhale. We release, inhale to prepare, exhale, push your body up. Move your feet parallel. We're just gonna go forward bend with the legs a little bit wider, inhale, and exhale, forward bend, catch your ankles, and we just go as far as we don't feel pain. We hold for four, and exhale. Let's go for three, and exhale. Two, and just one more. Inhale, and exhale, roll up. Wow, how do you feel? Feels good. Relax your shoulders. Move your legs. Well done. So this is the end of our mini routine. If you have time, remember, you can come back to the chapter and do it again. If you want to do it twice, the whole routine. If not, thank you for coming. So we're going to say goodbye with our three last breaths. So we go inhale, arms up. Exhale, drop your arms. <sighs> inhale through your nose. Exhale through your mouth. Just one more. And exhale. Hands back. Pray position. Thank you for joining us. Remember that you can find us on Instagram as a Sacred Body Studio. You can as well join our online classes in our online platform. Just You need to go to sacredbodystudio.com. You have all the information in the description. Remember to like, share, uh, leave us a comment. Always your comments help us to keep going and also give us ideas as well. And just talk with your friends about us, share, subscribe, and activate the bell. Thank you for coming. My name is Fabi, and we are Sacred Body Studio. See you in the next video.